Hey folks, this is Noble Rambler, and welcome back to Northgard. We've got a month until winter hits. We're fine on this. There's three goals for this episode. One, kick some blue butt. <laughs> Make blue go away. I think it's time to end blue. Two, find out what happens when it's just us and red left. Do they instantly turn aggressive and go after us? Right now we have good relations with them. Uh, red is the the uh, not is it goat or ram? I'm not sure what animal they're using, or what they call it. Three, find out what this is. What are the cobalts? I was doing some breeding, but no, I couldn't find anything really certain. Uh, it sounded like you could trade with them, and once they're defeated, then you can no longer trade, but they do give you gifts of some kind. But I wasn't quite sure what that meant, and I couldn't find any real examples of it. I didn't really search YouTube for other Let's Plays dealing with it, but um, I'm curious to see what actually happens here, and if there's anything uh, you know, surprising there. Um, three happiness. Oh, there's winter. There we go. I see we have four people. Let's fill this with whatever we can. Can I upgrade this? I can. So I can upgrade you. Uh, I can train one more Scald. And gain 50% happiness production bonus. Okay, we'll do that. And even put one more in there. Alright. So all the happiness that we can get is going to come right out of there. Otherwise, Blue is here. Blue is building a marketplace. They have their shield bearer camp there. This is their home base with a training camp and a woodcutter's lodge. They've got a farm. They got food, food, they got wood, and that's red. Where does blue end? Are we down to these four? We're down to these four. There is a trading post. They've got a shipwreck that's not been explored yet. Interesting. And they've got their own hall of skulls. Which is what this was. That must be one of their perks. So let's get everybody down to here. Let's eliminate their happiness. Let's make them not happy anymore. Do we really have that many? Wow. I'm thinking, is that somebody else? Our army coming in here too? Let's just make this tower go away. Yep. Boom. It is trying to take one of our guys down. But it's not going to get there. Alright, take you out. Now let's go back and sort out whoever just got injured. You. There we go. Everybody else, come on back in and say hi to this one. And Blaine there can go thump. A womp? Like he, he goes womp. Yeah. Alright, um, head over here. We'll just kind of take them down one map tile at a time. Red really can't jump in and take advantage of this. It's a definite barrier. they got to go through us to get to them in, in all cases. So all of these tiles are going to be ours. One just ran in, and she didn't have a chance. Okay, We're, we broke them. So let's take you and grab a villager and come in and work on what? Grab this one, even though we're not going to... Let's get them walking this way. There we go. You... Um... Hmm. Plus 14. I don't think I need the rest of these. Housing? We're doing fine. I guess we could leave a house over here. Alright. Work on you, and work on you. Okay. Otherwise, this can go away. Um, destroy you. Okay. And this can go away. We, 12 is 14. It's more than, well, it's 12 because of these two right here. Yeah, so let's make that go away and that 14 goes to 12. Alright, we don't need to be paying for all those. That maintains our 15. Otherwise we have to pay rent and all this. And two people should, actually three should have been making their way over here. There's two of them. I clicked right clicked all three of them into this space otherwise E come on over and we own this but this has already been explored yeah but the shipwreck hasn't we still have a scout we don't let's grab you make you a scout and then grab the scout and jump over to the shipwreck right there alright that's done 
All right, all of our army. We can? Let's go over here instead. Yeah, sorry guys, you just built that. I know you're, you're, you're trying, but um, you know, you, you picked the wrong side a long time ago. It's, uh, it's, it's time to pay the dues here. All right. They got you guys, and then I'm thinking we gotta get back because I can't even begin to pick my people out of there. Right there, you're get you're down. All right, come back in then. We lost one. Just come on in and take this tower out. All right, clean up the mess, leftovers, and this one is ours. All right, who is injured? Somebody over here, not you. <laughs> yeah, I'm just gonna have to wait. I can't. They're all st sitting on top of each other there. All right, there you go. Two of you are trying to get to where? Trying to just do your job, huh? Okay. And timer's done. Food is really hurting. Berserker, I need you to claim this one instead. And we do have to get that food ramped up if we're going to be taking property like this. All right. You guys sit here. Uh, houses. Hmm. Tell you what. Let's dump... Now, hmm. let's dump this house, and let's take both of you guys to here. This goes away, and if I go over here and click this, I should get the two that are closest to do this. What are you? Woodcutter. Wood, don't need it. You go away. House I do want, and I want you upgraded. And I want you to repair it. And this one, another trading post. I just don't need it. Scout just grabbed a whole bunch there. And a bunch of wood. Okay. Then let's go ahead and tear you down too. But we do have two villagers here now to be able to uh, go off and repair things that are nearby. Okay. Now, food. Let's think seriously about food. Uh -huh. What do we already own that is not fully stocked? Let's go there. We do have this to think about, too. In fact, you just go to work here. Okay. So anyway, you guys. Food. And any kobolds? It says it will spawn here, but I don't know if that is long done or not. Uh, will they spawn there until they are taken over? Now, I'm not seeing food in here. Not there. And that's full. Fish? Alright, there's three going right into there. Other food? Right there. That should finish off all of our villagers. Yeah, we got a food issue coming. We're not ready here yet. Alright, other food by chance. I'm just going to click on these guys, even though they're already doing something, just to be able to pass it over. Um, there. We could use more in, in this one, too. Hmm. We have two left. Let's do that as well. You're going there. Other foods. There was hunting over here. Yeah, we could send somebody over there. There's hunting here. That one's full. There's hunting here. That's full. We did destroy a couple of fish. Even, even though the ones we have, they're full. Yeah, we should see this start to uh, increase a bit when this is all done. Do we need to put more fish in? We have more available to us. You can go to that one. And... Hmm. I guess that's about it right now. I'm not going to be able to grab another chunk of land when we attack this. It's just going to sit here vacant. And maybe that's just going to have to be good enough. Though I'm hesitant to do it before the winter starts. Wow, we've got a ways to go, don't we? Hmm, we do. We're at plus 17 now. I would really like to see that go up higher. 
how do we get we're at plus eight we're, we're filling our our uh, village about as fast as we can right now uh, there's another one where is it that it tells me it's here every 46 days now so every month and a half so we've got the potential of two more villagers so a total of three by the time that uh, uh, that winter hits three more villagers No fish there. I can find fish by building fish. There you are. Yeah, nothing available there. It'll light up where it is. We could put one in here. And here. What are the other choices? There was one up in here, right? Well, maybe there was, but there are too many buildings there now. So... Apparently this is my best shot. Let's go ahead and do that. Grab a villager to, to do that job. Um, as far as improving tools of, let's, there's something else for us to do right now. So farmers, there we go. Hunters, we didn't do the fishermen and the hunters because we had so much food at one point. Scalds, sure. And what have we got up there? Seven left. Merchants and sailors tell you what let's go ahead and pick up some more since we've got the funds to pretty much do that um oh we've got a discount on it too so let's grab one more right there and that should improve tools for the merchants and that is everybody and leaves us some to pick up another berserker if we need to. Otherwise, improving... Let's see, stone right there. Any more buildings to improve? Now, if I had done this at the very beginning... Merchant. Um, maintaining... Merchant? No, that's what I want. Marketplace. Upgrade. Um, can train more. And they... 20% bonus. Okay. So... Uh, brings the money in faster, which wouldn't be a bad idea right now. There's not much more to... Have we upgraded? We have not. These guys could all be upgraded. So that gives us one extra. Oh, okay. And also, what, a 10% bonus? Is that what I saw? 10% attack bonus. Okay. We'll do these. We're out of stone. All right, let's grab a little more stone. Right there. And that's the merchant again. All right, that's what I want. Um, one, two, three. Put you in. Right there. Rallying is enabled, enabled, and enabled. Okay. The newer ones, I didn't click that, but we're not really using them to create uh, people. They're just placeholders to give us more more slots up in here. So now we can have up to 15. Um, the fish I put in to... Where am I? All right, the fish we just built here. No, yes. Let's grab everybody and put you in here. Everybody who is still available, you're no longer foraging, but you're doing a better job than foraging. If we gotta steal somebody, we'll steal them from the farm because that's seasonal. But the fishing and the hunting is year round. And that, even during the winter, we're at a plus two and there's still a couple of that are running in this direction, right? there. Okay. So, it says three of three, even though they haven't arrived yet. I'm getting the sense there's two there right now. Third one, where are you going? <laughs> oh, or this one. One, two. So there's still a third one yet coming. So we're at plus seven. Guess he didn't get the order. Let's get you in here. Nope, he's full. So he's still coming. Negative 68. Whoa. You get the sense that's based on our current economy, huh? Wow. Okay. Well, these guys are gathering food. And they have a silo. Oh, a silo would be helpful too, huh? All right. So let's just make that happen. Never mind. <laughs> All right. Let's go ahead and develop the area 400. Then build us a silo in here. And let's get one of these guys to do that. Where else do we have food that we can make sure that this 
never happens to us again. There's three here making happiness. I like happiness. Food. Food. There's a silo. Fish and a silo. Farm and a silo. Hunting and a silo. Done a pretty good job of keeping up with this already. Fishing, silo. Fishing, silo. Okay. We've got fishing and a silo. We've got hunting in a silo. Wow, I think we've got this covered. Hunting in a silo. And there's one more hunting over here. Our first one right there in a silo. Okay. We can't get any better than that. And we made it through. Still 988. All right, Berserker. Your timer is almost up. If we can buy one of these and you can conquer one of these, then we have got that beat and we've taken all the land. When do we start? First of spring? That's probably doable. You're going to do that. What are we lacking now? Lacking wood because it's all going to firewoods. So that's not a problem. There's almost 10,000 woods. That's definitely not a problem. Uh, we're lacking soldiers is probably it. So we've got six warriors. We could use some more axe throwers. Let's take... This got done? This got done. Let's take all of these two and make them axe throwers. You're right there. One, and there's one way out over there. It's going to come running all the way back in there. Let's upgrade that one. Eight left. Is there anything else worth upgrading? We do have people working here, and they're going to get a bonus if it's upgraded, so we'll do that. Okay. You, we've got two of three. We could put the next... Don't have a next yet, do we? We might. We do. You're right there. Do we make you an axe or do we make you a gatherer of lore? You. Why can't I do that? Stop the raid. Now can I put you in there? I can. You run in there. <clears throat> then we will continue the raid. And you're out of here. And then we will take a look at this. Alright, what is left? Field rations. That's probably pretty smart right now. Cartography. And that's it. Okay. That's done. Alright, so no villagers are available, but we've got all the food come in that we can possibly make at the moment. And E, let's get everybody out over here, including the two or three we just made. I would like to hit this one and then that one, but I don't think I've got the opportunity to do that. So in that case, who do we actually have in here? We have a couple of warriors. And you kind of look like, uh, yeah, you just got repositioned into there. Probably a mistake. You had a great big axe before. Uh, pull back. And then take him. All of them looking at greens. He's going down pretty fast. But we're going to take that building down so fast that we're not going to go any further there. Okay. Let's... What's the chance I can find you? Right there. You go that way. You are who? You're a shield bearer. Okay. Everybody's fine here. We'll let the shield bearer back in just in time to uh, be part of the, of the takedown. There it is. He is defeated. Red is still in good relations with us. Thank you very much. All right, you are not ours. Ah, okay, Berserker, head over to here and take this land for us. And, oh, we still have peoples here. Okay, come on over. Is this attacking? I guess it is. Okay. I want what? I just want this farm. Okay, so, Berserker, take the land. That didn't happen, did it? Why did it not happen? Okay, you, plane. I don't know, because I have to take this one first. Colonize for you, and now, Berserker, can we do this quickly? Not until that happens. I think I'm going to have to rebuild the farm. Now I can take this land. Give me a villager. And head over here. Head over here. There we go. 
Everything else can burn down. That's fine. Alright, I want you to repair this one. If it's still repairable. E, all of you guys, head to... What is our new front line? And we can almost end it just by plowing right through here and being done. But I'd kind of like to explore peace for a little while. So, if I were to send you guys all here... Hmm. Don't have many villagers. Did you make it yet? You're running from who knows where. Yeah, this is probably all toast. Let's take you down. I'm thinking I could build a whole bunch of defense towers. If I had more villagers to uh, spread out and do the, uh, do the work. Food's at 37. Wood's at 29. Gold's at 22. Alright, you made it. And you started. Alright. Clean that mess up. And I have a sheep over here. That would be better off living right here. Though it really only counts if he's living at places where people are posted, like villagers. But I don't have any villagers. I guess it doesn't matter. These guys, I'm sure, are getting very nervous. What is he going to do? We got their tower. Let's analyze their defenses. We can't touch them anywhere around here. So this is the next entry point at this end. Yep. Over here, we've got a horrible swamp to go through. Or we've got this land over here. Hmm. Well, I'm thinking we're going to position our folks over here. And Blaine, can you do me a favor and just kind of go camping over here? And let's go ahead and get a tower built right here. And let's put one villager. Well, didn't mean to do that. Got to remember to right-click it. Where am I at? There. Right-click villager. And go there. Then, it'd be nice to have a tower here. Villager. Hopefully not the same one, but just in case, I'll go ahead and click this one again. Okay, good. Then, I don't think I can put a third building in the swamp. I can. Oh, okay. Not many building spots, but I, you can go there. Okay. Third villager? Not you. Good. So that one's building. That one's building. And... That one's building. Haha, <laughs> I didn't steal my labor. Good. We have fish over here. We could upgrade this if we had more stone. And bring in a little more food. We do need a chance to build up our food reserves. We do. Money's still looking fine. So let's... Let's see. Villagers, 80 of 87. I wonder if we could hit 100 villagers. Let's... Yeah, we do need to do some, some upgrading. We need to upgrade all the stuffs. We need to stock all the buildings. Get the other fish... Or... Hello. Rats. They spread disease to ten members. We have plenty of silos. I didn't even notice there was a rat invasion coming. Alright, we've got to kind of work our way through this mess here too. But seven and seven. You see how quickly our, our four um, healers are working their way through the, the kingdom and curing everybody. But um, what was I doing? I want to buy stone. Alright, so five. Let's buy out everything. That left us still sitting pretty good, and it leaves nothing for red to buy. Okay. With that, we could upgrade some silos. So that, I guess, it, yes, it does. It brings in uh, more production for the food of that tile. But I'm surprised I haven't upgraded this one. We upgraded the original one, which was... I thought it was right here. At the, there it is. Yeah, that one's upgraded. I didn't get that one done. So what other things have we not upgraded that would be good? Like this defense tower. This defense tower. And... Red actually... No, they don't have access to this one. They can't go through the water. And they apparently have no healers. They have a lot of injuries. And they're staying that way. Upgrade the defense tower. Okay. Um, 
Other buildings that would do us a bonus. These sort of things are upgraded. Never mind. Okay. All right. Scalds upgrade does what? Increases happiness more. Okay. And we only have one person working here. One of three and three of three. This is the other one I wanted to boost. One of three. Let's stop this raid. And let's put two more into here. And get that coming in. Though really what's it doing for us now? If you think about it, it's bringing in lore. And it's bringing in crowns. So that's part of this. Merchants are bringing in 36. That's a lot. So yeah, we'll maintain that. We don't really need the lore anymore. All we have left is cartography, and that's that's not needed. But I'm bringing in more fame isn't going to do us any good. Increases your fame if you claim King of Northgard. But you never hit King until you actually just win. Okay. You guys have now three of three, but only one, two are there. Where is our... He's probably running in from the very far reaches of Northgard. Yep. There she is. Okay. We'll let her get there and do her thing while we're kind of looking around again. So these are both upgraded. I could put two more into here. And that'll guarantee that we're going to stock this as fast as we can. That sounds reasonable. Alright. Hop in there. Do your little grunty thing. Arr, and start raid. Okay. You guys do that. Now, of the other three, let's put two of you in here. And then what? What else is there to do right here? We could put a silo in here. Build silo right there. And eventually stock this, but I'll let that happen. You have been upgraded. Okay. The other farm? The original farm? I don't get the sense that was ever upgraded. It wasn't. Alright, we'll do that. Alright, you have not been upgraded. Ooh. Earthquake. Soon. And there's nothing to do here to help us. No. Alright, more buildings that are looking raw. These can. We're not going to upgrade those. You, Scout Camp, have been upgraded. Okay, So I think we're kind of sitting about as good as we're going to sit, other than a couple more houses, now that we're trying to go for some more population. I do need three to four villagers before this hits, and we're bringing them in, whoa, every 40 days now. So no problem there. We are going to need more houses just to... Uh, Keep up until we finally do take out red. Yeah. Let's... There was a place that had a silo but no food. It was earlier on, so it was kind of out in here. And it had to do with... There. Yeah. Is there a house there? There is already. Okay. So this is a place that we could put people... And they can gather live at the house and put into the silo, but okay, that's taken care of already. Hmm. Okay, well, let's put in another couple of houses. House. Put one in here. And build you. And another house. Put you in here. And build you. And in case you stole from that one, we'll click you in. Alright, so with that... I would say we have advanced ourselves as far as we pretty much can. There are a few more buildings that can be upgraded. Not many. All the silos could. But food, wood, and gold are coming in at a, at a reasonable rate now. All that's really left is to go and attack red. The game is not going to automatically attack us. We could just continue playing for probably another I don't know I was gonna say another 20 episodes but build trade route but I get the sense that where's the original one here-ish that this is gonna degrade by what is it called 
expected happiness. The longer you run the game, I think the longer, the, the bigger that 51, that red number gets. Chipping away at this, you've got to be expanding at a certain rate all the time in order to, I need more stone, in order to uh, maintain the happiness. So this makes sure that you can't play the game for too long. Um, stone, let's go ahead and do we have any left to, to buy? It restocked a little bit. We'll take you and you. And that's enough to get this house upgraded and this house upgraded. With that, we're good for a population of 103. And I don't think that we can go much further than that. Okay. I could take some of these down, though. That should help us out. Defense tower is no longer needed. Yeah, let's think about that. Other defense towers... That were needed at one time, they're not anymore. I don't see us falling back. They still don't have any way to heal themselves. They're still have injured out here. Oh, maybe that's been corrected now. Or those people have just died. I'm still not seeing a healer's hut, though. No, I don't see a healer's hut in there. Oh, there it is right there. They do have a healer's hut now. Okay. And I can tell me how many. If I can see one very slowly doing the work. Okay. Hmm. So defense towers that could come down. They're no longer needed. You. And that will save us quite a bit of monthly rent. You. Okay. Red. You're threatening these two. Only. I don't see you overrunning us. So this could go away. This could go away. Right? Yeah. And one thing that all the enemies have done that I never have. So the, the game automatically builds a defense tower right at their town hall. If we had had that when Yellow was hitting us with mercenaries, that would have helped out. So there's something I've got to remember from now on. I'll always build a tower right next to this guy. Just to back us up or something like that but you are protecting from there i think we are pretty much set for next episode never mind repair that one boy now we got a lot of territory to cover to try to find them and no that's not a fire <laughs> all right where's more flamey things you go there you go there i think we got all the burning buildings this won't click me between them, so if that goes away, then we're fine. It's not gone away yet. Why is it not gone away yet? Something's still burning down. Nope, now we're good. Okay. Now, where's the trading post that is selling wood to these guys? Is that still a thing? Incoming trade plus two. Trading posts. Now, I can't build... Nothing I can do to say, take me to all of the trading posts. I right click, nothing. Okay. If I go here and double click, nothing. Build trade route, build trade route. None of them say cancel trade route. So maybe we are no longer building or trading with Red Eric to advance that relationship. You, no. And that's just sucking up money right now. Okay. So by getting rid of all these buildings, we've gone from 24 to 26, back to 25 again. Building upkeep went up again. That's odd. Anyway, I think I have gone as far as I can go. I've come up with all the busy work I can think of without destroying red. Maybe I won't record this one for a few days. Let me know in the comments. Do we take out red? Or do we call this a victory? and live with our, our our ram neighbors and live in peace. What do you think? Do we peace out? Or do we go in for the kill? Hmm. Okay. Well, I think we'll stop it right there. This has been Noble Rambler. I thank you guys for watching, and I'll catch you next time. Bye-bye.